Okay. Um, this video will be about memes and relationships. And um, when I say that, it's about, you know, you know all the relationship means that say you should treat your girl like this or like that. And like, yeah, it works. But not for everybody. Not everybody want to be treated like this or like that. Like, uh, women are different. Like, a lot of women are way different. I have I haven't dated a lot, but, like, there's a lot of women in my family, and I feel like each one of them are different. And, like, they accept certain things. And a lot of memes misconstrue, like, you might agree with it, but... Don't go into a relationship thinking, oh, I'm going to treat my girl. Just like this meme said, because it's good, definitely supposed to work. It doesn't. It's not supposed to work. It's, it's Memes are a lot of opinions, especially the relationship ones, to me, seem like they're opinion-based. Or it works for you, but it's not guaranteed to work for the next man. So, you, I don't feel like... I used, I used to... <laughs> I felt like I was the meme king when it came to, like, relationships and shit. Like, I, I ain't even gonna lie, I've been in a lot of DMs. And sending memes was my way to communicate with them. I mean, that's how I got in my, um, my current relationship, through memes. But it was a lot. I sent her a lot of DMs. Man, they were most, uh, probably 95% of them were memes. They were all probably relationship based. Some were funny. Some hit. Some didn't. But I mean, me, like I used to think like, if I treat my girl like these memes say, I'll have a long, happy relationship. No arguments. No nothing. But it's it's just not. It's not that way. You won't. If you feel like memes are like your relationship advice, it's. Your, your relationship is doomed from the start because you can't you can't expect the means to give you all the answers and it's just it's not going to work that way you can't it just won't also I think the um, relationship means put women in a box it's like it's like I was saying earlier it's just, it, it expects every woman to want to be treated the exact same way, but that's that's putting all of them in a, a closed box. And like, I know for a fact, I know for a fact that that's not the way to go. It's just don't don't listen to the relationship memes. Don't expect your girl to be wanted like. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong or miss true what I'm saying. Because they like this sweet shit sometimes. Like, some of the memes do be on point, And if you use some of them, it works. Don't, don't get it twisted. Some of them do work. But to base your whole relationship off of using memes and, uh, like, using what they say, that doesn't work. But some of the shit does work. I'm not even going to lie to you. Because there's a lot of shit that I do... I got from memes or like I've always thought about doing but this meme said it exactly that's that's where I get in trouble at well not really trouble but that's where my mind goes sometimes too because like I be thinking about oh this would be cool but then I see it on a meme and then I post it and be like oh you got that and like you know, let's say I try to carry out the idea but I also see a meme that said the same thing and I post a meme but that like, originally, I feel like, shit, that was my idea first, and someone fucking put it in the meme. Like, they was reading my mind or something, but most of the time, like, all I, I don't know, this is, this is weird, because, like, memes got me somewhere, shit, but for me to be downplaying them like they're nothing is kind of weird, but anyway, all I really wanted to say is just be careful with the memes and relationships, like, the relationship means it's okay to maybe form an opinion of a chick with one, but don't 
don't listen to it to a T and carry it out throughout the entire relationship and expect everything to be perfect when it's not going to be perfect. Yeah, <laughs> I think I think that came out the way I wanted it to. So um, I hope this video makes sense. Felt like I was just rambling, but I probably was. But enjoy. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram. I'll. Oh, that also I wanted to touch on that a little bit. A few people hit me up um, about my Instagram being deleted or why'd you block me on Instagram? I didn't block anyone. It's not deleted. It's temporarily disabled. I did that because for one, I need to take a step back from Instagram because really, I I got I had to take a step back from Instagram because of I mean it's a lot. I know it's fun to scroll and use the explore page, find funny memes and shit, but I just felt like I needed to take a step back and like kind of get myself together and not formulate opinions off of memes, especially within my relationship, because I feel like I was doing that a little too much and I needed to cut back on that, like at least attempt to talk, like find shit to talk about. So that's really why I disabled my Instagram. Um, I'm going to give myself probably another week or two off of Instagram. Maybe probably another, probably around Christmas I'll probably be back on Instagram. But other than that, that's, that's really, I also wanted to touch on that. Because, yeah, so I didn't delete or block anyone off of Instagram. I just, I'm just taking a, a big step back from it for a little bit. Try to get my mind together and... Um, I heard once you, sometimes you just got to take a step back from everything to get yourself together. So that's basically what I was doing. So, um, but still, um, all my social medias will be in the description probably. So if you want to follow me, you can. Um, if not, that's cool too. Subscribe, like, share, all that. Thank you.